Hey hello guys it's how to tech simplified and in this easy tutorial I will be showing you how to actually fix the Fortnite error code LS0016. It's a very easy tutorial so let's get straight into it. The first thing that we want to do is go to the search bar. Type in Epic Games Launcher and right here the application opens up. Now make sure to right click it and run as administrator. Press the yes and now we're in administrator mode that can also fix the issue so try to launch your game now what we will do next is type in fort sorry go to the library and go to fortnite right here now sometimes the files are disrupted now what we will do is right click the fortnite page and from there go to manage now from here verify the files because sometimes there are corrupted files inside the folder of fortnite so simply verify the files and now Epic Games will start to verify Fortnite. Now if this still didn't fix you, your issue, I got another fix which is very easy but make sure to follow along. Now here go to the search bar and type in not work. Now here we view the network connections and we get a couple of options to choose from. Now here are all your current connections. Now if you're using Wi-Fi choose the Wi-Fi option. If you use an Ethernet cable choose the Ethernet cable. Now from here we right click the option that we are using. From there go to properties and once you're in properties we're going to the Internet Protocol version 4. The TCP IPv4. Now simply press properties and here your window should look something like this obtain dns server address automatically what we will choose is use the following dns server addresses now for the pervert dns server we're going to choose the following 8888 and then for the alternate dns server we choose 8844 now from there press ok and that can also fix your issue so try to reload a, a fortnite and check if this helped now we're going to do one last method which will most likely fix your issue so stick along with me now for this last method we're going down to the search bar once more and we type in cmd now here command prompt shows up and we right click it and we run it as administrator now once command prompt opens up it should look something like this now from here we type in a command which is n-e-t-s-h spacebar win suck spacebar reset now what this will do it will reset the winsock catalog and make sure that your computer is running nicely again now if this tutorial has helped you in any kind of way, please leave a like and subscribe. If you still got any questions, leave them in the comments down below. But most importantly, thank you for watching.